signs of darkness here in Red Creek Valley. The first you walked into, and with any luck, walked out of. But the other darkness was deeper, stickier, uh, unknowable. And it wanted me to leave. Hello everybody, Satchel here. And welcome to another episode of Finding... Or no, not Finding, The Vanishing of Ethan Carter. So... We got cleared up whatever the problem was there. I think it was a problem with the autosave, but uh, we got to hear the voice over there. Okay, go under. Yes, okay. So, we have a couple things to do here. We have a house over here. We got water that I can't go in. Nope. I don't think that's a house. We definitely have something over there, but we're going to go into this house first. See what we can do. Can't open the door. We can't open the door. Okay. We can't go around the back. Now well, that stinks. Really, I can't open the door. Okay. Well, I guess we don't have anything over there to do yet. Looks like we'll go over here first. So hopefully that was that little glitch last time was just a, a minor thing. Not a big deal. This looks like a side entrance here. Just want to look, make sure there's nothing else we can do or see. High voltage. Okay. It's a good Linkin Park song too. Oh, uh, we got doors, we got more doors, windows. It's probably gonna be the only door in, but Always check your perimeter. Can't go in there. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Whoa. That was a not intended. Okay. Yep. Let's go back around. We need to get inside. I am curious. Like, can I take that lift back up now that I'm down here? I don't really need to, but I'm curious. But we all know what that did to the cat. Okay. In we go. Oh, what do we have? Wall mounted case. Axe shape. Yep, I see it. Fire axe cabinet. I don't know why it would be darker. Where's the axe? Where's the axe? Oh. It's over there. In the floor. Okay. What else is around? Oh, I see a dead body. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, yeah. Nobody in here. Okay. Spec destroyed from the inside, from the outside. Excessive force, desperation, rage. Broken door. There's the axe. Okay, I don't... There's not any blood on it. We're gonna take it. Let's check this guy out. Victim cornered. Punctured throat, yep. No footprints, signs of struggle. Touch him. Nope. Touch that neck wound. Anything there? Okay, let's inspect this next. We've returned pin holder. Hmm. Nope. Getting closer, though. Ah, scissors. That's what you got stabbed with. Oh, it's on the lift. I knew it. I freaking knew it. Okay. Now, if we touch him, do we get anything more? No. Okay. Alright. 
Yep, broken door. Is that really all we can do in this whole place? Are you serious? Well, that's kind of a disappointment. Alright, let's go check out... Let's go look at the scissors. I believe this is... Yeah, this is where they are. I feel like there's gonna be... Are they broken? No, they're not broken. Bloody. Anything else here? Oh, we can go up. <coughs> Sorry about that. Okay, before we go up, I just want to make sure that... Because I'm wondering if now that I have an axe, or the scissors... Maybe something will let me get into this building. Maybe. It's probably gonna I'm probably gonna have to find a key somewhere. Yeah, this is like a metal door. It's not like I can use inventory items. Okay. Um Well, I guess we'll go up, see what happens. Ding, 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 ding. I do like the music. I know I've said that a lot. Yeah, let's go up. Not making that mistake again. Getting on it before I push up. This might be a minute. Let's look at the beauty. Look at that. How cool is that? For an older game, man, I'm telling you what. Wonder where they're getting all their power from. Okay, why did we come back up? Not real sure. think we need to be over here. I don't think we need to be up here, but I'm kind of baffled as to where to go next. Um, hmm. This thing needs like a journal. Gotta be missing something. I don't think it's in here. Nope, nope, nope. Oh. Okay. Keep going up. Isn't this the one with the fake room or something? No? Is it it? Okay. That's cool. Hey, what's this? Dad was sad, Mom was mad, Travis was loud, Grandpa was quiet, Uncle Chad was mean. Must have missed that before. I don't remember that. Is there anything new in here? No? Alright, I'm gonna look around... Um, just to see if I can figure out where I'm supposed to go next and when if I figure that out then I'll bring you right back alright I'll see you in a minute okay we back so um, the only thing I can figure is I wasn't able to sense that body I think it was Dale maybe um, so I'm gonna retrace my steps here we already did that over there 
I'm gonna go back in here and start here. Oh, hey, fix. We fixed it. Okay, so now with that back in place, do I need to, oh, I bet I need to put the scissors back in place. Yep, see, see? Yes, okay. Now we got it. Okay, they're gonna go outside. Yep. We got one that's wanting to stay in here. Maybe. Whoa! Oh, it's a sequence of events. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. This one shouldn't be too difficult, right? Because we kind of know... Where's the other one? Here's one. Okay. Um, in the mine? Is there another one? Probably not, right? Let's see. Is there anything over here? No. Okay, let's go back over here. Don't... Can I not... Apparently I need to keep going through here. Maybe. No! No, no, no. No, 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 no. Dang it! Okay, I'm going to go back, sense the body, and I'll be right back. Okay, let's let's try this one more time. Okay, see, now uh, this was the last one. Okay. Um, well, obviously this was last, right? This is going to be pretty straightforward, I feel. Um, four. That's five. Yep. I mean, it's pretty linear. Three. Two. One. Where's my mother? Why are you standing in the sleeper's way? She had an accident. Travis, put down the axe. Okay, that was right. An accident. I, I didn't want her to get hurt. We're all so sick. You know, since Ethan found that room. Yeah. Where's Ethan, goddammit? Talk to me! Okay, okay! He wants to burn Vandegrift's room. Look, Travis, just, just... Just leave me alone! I don't know who Travis is, but he's looking for Ethan, too. Oh, God. Oh, God! The sleeper chooses vessels. You know that? To enact his wishes, he chose Mom. He chose me. Oh, that's why he's looking for Ethan. Son, I don't want to hurt you. You think scissors are going to save you? Yes. Oh. Well. It have to be this way. You could have helped the sleeper. Helped us. But Mom's right. You're a coward. And you'll be meeting Ethan again soon. Um... Where are you going? Going outside. Go, go, go. Alright, following you. 
I'm fi oh, slow down. Well, you gotta let me in the door. Let me guess, the door's open now. Yep. I'm shocked. You disturbed it, not me. Travis, we can get rid of it. I know exactly what we're up against. Don't listen to what's in your head. Oh, that was Ethan. What can can we do something this here? Sleeper was feeding on them. Their hate, their distrust. Ethan's father figured suicide wouldn't feed it, but it did. I could feel it sitting somewhere out there, fat as a bullfrog, digesting. I don't know if this is doing anything. Oh, it turned it off. Oh ho! Okay. What does that do for us? Could we walk across this before? I don't know that we could. Well, I mean, I hadn't been over here, so... Not entirely sure. Um... Hmm. Let's see... Yeah, I think maybe there's more in that building. That's pretty cool. Are all the turbines shut off? Can we turn that one off? That one's not running. That one's not running. They're all turned off. Ooh, what's up here? Anything up here? No. Okay. Head back down. Unlock the door. Oh, how did I get... How did I get in there, then? Right? I mean... So weird. Okay, um... I should be able to go across that, but I can't. Maybe down there? Oh, maybe right here I can. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Okay. Now. Hmm. Well, we have a path. Let's follow the path. Is this a this is a path, right? Yeah, this is a path. It's gotta be. It's not stopping us. Okay. More water. Oh, is this a bridge? Ethan was close. Oh. I could feel him. A pinprick of light in the darkness. He would know me. He would know why I'd come. If Ethan's close, does that mean we're close? I mean, I kind of feel like it does. Look at that water. Okay, let's keep going. Yeah. What's over here? Oh. Is that a... That is a burned house. Ethan, what did you do? It's still smoldering.
E what? What? This is the Vandergriff home. Okay. Nothing in here. Nothing back there. Just looking for clues at this point. Um, what? I mean, I know I can rotate those things, but what is that going to do? And how am I supposed to know what, it ro what to rotate them to? Right? I mean, just because you can. I mean, that's the only thing that's next, though, right? I mean, that's the only thing we can do. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. All right, let me think about this. We have A, we have C. Hmm. Oh, we lost sound again and movement. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. So it definitely looks like this game has some sort of issue with where it saves the game. Um, I'm not real sure, so I'm going to come back over here. Um, oh, wait, wait, what is this? What is that? Ordo Corvus. Ordo Corvus. Um, I can't spell Ordo, can I? No, I mean, it's only three letters. But I can C-O-R-V-U-S. That's got to be it, right? C. Okay, so Corvus, only the V, which means this has to be the R. This has to be the O. Oh, we're doing it. This is the S. That's the U. We did it. Open the door. Get on the floor. What did we open? Oh. Oh. Oh, jeez. Is that guy alive? Yeah, he's quite dead. Um, charred? Peaceful? What is that? Touch it. Oh, we got another chronology to do. Okay, where are they going? Oh, they're all right here. Okay. Oh, this is Ethan. Um, okay. Let's think about this. He's got the cans. He's got the table. We got four of them. Um. Okay. Well, I know the one where the guy dies has got to be the last one. I'm just going to try this in the order I think, right? So, four, three, two, one. Let's watch it. Ethan, 
I fought it off. It's okay. Grandpa, get away from me. Your grandmother, Gail, is protecting me from it. Ethan, I can help you. Poor Grandpa. I found Vandergris's diary. He said for the sleeper to wake up, someone has to suffer. Look! When I found that what? room, I didn't wake him up. He's trying to wake up now. Vandergriff kept his victims alive. He made them suffer. That's what the sleeper wants. We need to get in that room. So get in the room. I can squeeze through. A brave little dude. It has to be this way. The sleeper must not wake. Burning the room won't matter, Ethan. The sleeper's inside us now. Grandpa! Get back! We all have to die. Even you. Even me. What? What? Oh, he's just going to take it, huh? Okay. You going to open the door? Yep, you sure are. Hey, Ethan. Wake up, buddy. Ethan, wake up. Well, kid, you stopped it. Did I find him? But you stopped it. Paul Prospero? Are you... Are you really here? I'm sorry, Ethan. I was late. Too late. You're right. You were too late. What? Here. Again. I knew this story. And it was Ethan's as much as it was mine. And it wasn't finished. Not yet. What? Bridge. The dam. Church. This place. Story. What is that? What is that? Mm-hmm. Travel and travel. Um, hmm. So I need to go, I'm guessing need to go there. Okay, well, um, here's what I'm not sure about. So I tried to break her up in the wall, but she's tough. She fought me. In the end, I couldn't do it, not to my wife. She and the sleeper's pretty easy. I decided who I felt fear more. Not myself, not been myself. Was it going to date? Let me just say this is most vexum. Hmm. Okay, um, whoa. God, that thing scares me. Okay, so let's go there. I mean, right? I must have missed something. Oh. Oh, I can go back and forth. Okay, all right. So, something to do with maybe the switch or a bear trap? It's a bear trap. It's the traps. That's what it is. The traps I ran into, right? Is it the traps? Where? 
Okay, we gotta find the traps. Okay, nothing there. Trap. I don't have everything I need. Okay, I'm, I'm understanding. Yep. Alright. There's something else. Something over here? Yep. Oh, it's close. Okay, there's like one more. Bear trap. Nope, one more. Where is it? Where is it? This way? No, that's the way around. It's got to be right here with the rest of them. There it is. Did we do it? We did it. Um, what? Read it. Sap. An old man came to the forest every day to drink sap from the trees. To get there, the old man had to step around many dangerous traps. The villagers believed this old man had hidden a jade amulet in the forest, but the old man wanted the villagers to believe this because then they would search the forest for treasure and not drink his sap. One cool fall night, someone set fire to the forest and the fire spread to the village. The old man escaped the fire by covering himself in sap. When he returned to the village, he found all the villagers' bones. The old man sat down and cried. Then he found more sap to drink. Ethan, wow. I told you, you can't be here. But, Gramp, I wrote something for you. That's real nice. Thank you. Just just leave it. I'll read it later. Okay. So, there was another one that I needed to do. And I bet... Oh, you know what? I'm going to go back and travel, but I bet it was where that... I bet it's down there. Actually, I'm pretty sure it is, because that's where it showed it on the map. Nope, I'm going to travel. I know it's a little bit slower. Um, I feel like... I know we should... I know we're way over time here, but... I feel like this is near the end of the game. Yeah, traps and skulls. We've done all of those. There's something at that car. Where it was sitting, maybe? What is this? What? Where am I? Um... Yes, what is that? What is this? Blue? Nope. Whoa! Spaceman? This game is so weird. Good lord, this game is weird. He go up? Yep. I see him. Where are we headed? Dude, where are you taking me? Okay. Come on. Where is he? There he is. 
Oh! What is that? What is that? Where the heck am I? Yep, officially the weirdest game I've ever played. If you... <laughs> if you've ever played this before, and you've just been waiting on me to just weird out, congratulations, we've reached the tipping point. We have jumped the shark, folks. What? Wait. Extraterrestrial containment capsule. Well, that was nice of them to label it. Oh, there's more. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. I am losing my mind. Oh, here we go. Of course there's something to read. Fangs. The beast had fangs, but was heavy and slow. So when it saw the light in the sky, it waited, thinking the light would go out like the others before it. When it did not, the beast rose up on its legs and went to the place where the fire was still burning. As the orange light died, another took its place. This one was blue, a bright and pure blue that the creature had only seen along the edges of the stars. The beast showed its fangs and the light vanished. A moment later, the light appeared again between two distant, distant trees. The beast wanted to go home, but could not ignore the light, so it chased it deeper into the forest. Get out of my room, Travis! Stories, stories, always with the stories. Get out! I read the Fangs one. I liked uh, the beast. At least he gets to leave this goddamn place. Alright. And we're in a treehouse, right? Hey, what is this? Gaylord. <laughs> That's got to be Travis's work. Okay, we're here. I guess I gotta go back. Right? There it is. Okay. Well, that was lucky. I don't know how I saw that. That should take me back to the room. Yep. Now, now that I've done everything, right? Can I just do this? Christ, Ethan, you're in here again? You missed dinner. Mom and Dad are pissed. They've been looking all over the place. Get out of here, Travis. Leave me alone. <laughs> hey, Ma, he's in here. Honey, be careful with that lamp. Damn. The hell's wrong with your kid? Painting on walls, writing his stories. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck? Ethan! For God's sake. You missed dinner! I'm sorry. I've been working on a story all day. How long have I been out here? The Adventures of Paul Prospero, Supernatural Detective. Where do you get this stuff? Pop, would you get Travis out of here, please? He draws pictures on walls. What the hell is that? Chad? Shut up! You got yourself a faggot for a son, Dale. Travis, let's go. Come on. Faggot! Ethan, you're a fucking faggot! Travis, stop it! Oh no. Oh, shit! Shit! Everyone! Go! Get out! Ethan! Get out! There's the smoke, it's toxic! Oh Jesus! Oh God! What do we do? What do we do? We can't stay here! Oh no, Ethan. Wait, was I a story the whole time? Is that what's going on? I was a story. 
I was one of his stories. I wrote about you, but I don't know if I created you. You made me real. I can't go yet. I have to finish my story about you. I wrote stories about everyone. I know you did, but my story's done, and it's a fine story. I can let go? You can let go. What happens then? Another story, kid. What else? What? So he's dead, right? Yeah, that room's completely on fire. They're getting buckets of water. She's a big gal. That dude ain't helping none. He's trying to put him out. He's got his axe. What are you going to do with that axe? Is that it? Um, it's very pretty. Well, I'm going to assume this is the end of the game. <laughs> I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Yeah, I think that's it. Um, roll credits. Roll credits. Yep, okay. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I mean, I did. I, I gotta say, I did enjoy it. It was a good, um way to pass the time in between other series it weirded me the hell out i have to say um kudos to you guys the astronauts that was the weirdest game i have ever played um and it kind of screwed with my mind in the end a little bit but i enjoyed it i hope you guys did too if you did be sure and leave a like let me know if you run across any other weird games and uh, we'll try them out until next time Hope you guys enjoyed it, and as always, if I don't talk to you before, I'll talk to you later.